quick. I think I'll need to put some sort of bushing So it's there um it's Sunday, but if you guys are watching this, you're probably watching it on Tuesday. Yeah, I'll probably do because that. I went fishing Monday, which I'll go fishing, but it's when you see it never mind. So anyways, um <laughs> happy Tuesday, but it's really Sunday. Okay, so um, we're doing a couple of additional pieces that I didn't get a chance to include because I hadn't made them yet. Um, and I also wanted to include something else that I really think is worth saying. So let's go ahead and watch that right now. Okay, so I wasn't going to make a video today, but I am. Um, and I'm probably going to include this piece with tomorrow's and put it all together. But I have to include this piece because this piece is important. Because so many times today in, in our world, the, the niceties and the do the right things don't happen. But y'all did. Pure Fishing, this is a shout out directly to you. I have this Revo STX 30, which if any of you guys have ever purchased one, know that it's not an inexpensive reel. It costs about $200. It's one of my favorite spinning reels. I use it just about every time I go fishing. But I had some issues uh, a couple of videos ago. Now it was cold, so I thought maybe that had something to do with it. But my drag slipped. I missed some fish. I was kind of bummed about it. So I called. You have to call Georgia. And when you call Georgia, they reference you to Iowa, to Spirit Lake, Iowa, which is where Pure Fishing's warehouse and uh, repair center is located. So I did all that. I called Atlanta. Uh, they asked when the purchase was made and did I have proof of a uh, purchase at that point. And I did that particular order from Tackle Warehouse. Well, you can see it wasn't a cheap order. I ordered some other Abu products and a whole bunch of other stuff as well. But this was three months out of warranty. So by rights, Pure Fishing didn't have to repair it for free. But guess what? They did. Um, I sent this in on the, 20, the 25th of January, and I got it back today. Today being February 2nd, tomorrow is Sunday, which is when this video is going to come out. And y'all rocked it and charged me nothing. You guys replaced the one-way clutch on a reel that was out of warranty. Um, contact customer service for free hoodie information. And you're going to give me a hoodie because I spent a lot of money with you guys over the years. So I, I know when you spend, it's like over 60 or $70, you get a hoodie, um, but they're going to send me one for, so thank you. I just, you know, you, a lot of times the little guy gets lost in big companies. Thank you for not losing the little guy. Once again, you prove that you're a reputable company and I'm going to stick with you guys. So thank you, Pure Fishing, for repairing my reel that was out of warranty for free. I'll get that last and one. and there's a lot of background noise um, in this video because I'm watching. You guys ever watch this guy? This is Marlin Bates, and he's making. Well, this is the third video, but he's making a fishing reel out of wood, and um, like a really bulletproof glass. Basically, it's it's the polycarbonate plastic that's not plastic. It's really. I mean, it's just a bunch of chemicals that is really strong. But he's just, um, go check him out. Uh, he, uh, you guys probably already know who he is. Um, just amazing, amazing. That guy. Yeah, he's good. So um, today we're going to turn him down just for a second. Um, actually, I want to pause him just for a second. Hang on. I'll get right back to you guys. Because I want to see the rest of the video. But I do have a couple of additional pieces to show you. You guys saw this before it went into clear coat. These are those copper craws. And I just wanted to show them to you out of the clear coat. And the deep red veining in the backs. The 3D. That's pretty. It's just pretty. It's pretty. So... So what'd you guys think? I mean, Abby really rocked it out. They hooked me up and I will uh, continue to be happy with them. And there's the rest of them. Kevin coming your way on Tuesday. Today, but anyways, it's, it's not Tuesday. I hope I'm making sense. This is a yellow frog, folks. Or as I like to call it, old blue eyes. 
heading out to a pond near you today. These are all outgoing orders. They usually are. And uh, this is that deep summer craw. And I know the blue glove kind of messes with the colors on the bait sometimes. So I'll try and give you... I recently got a question if I would um, make a video on how to paint eyes on baits on these blanks that don't that you don't insert the 3d eyes and yes I will as a matter of fact I've gotten a couple of really good questions and I'm going to focus on those questions on the next spray session coming this week this week folks don't have to wait much longer because it'll be out shortly um, here is the house of black and white so there's the white one, here's the black one, and these were auctioned off earlier, so obviously I'm doing this video late in the day. These are going out to Ron, and Ron here, um, on its way. So I'm just going to go ahead and send this, which should have come on something else, with these. So this will be with these, these two. And that's the short and long version of it this morning. I've got a couple other things that are on here, um, but that's not like I'm going to, this is a repaint. This is going to be a repaint. So this is going to be specifically for trout. Big, big, big trout. Big. And we'll talk to you guys soon. I hope you guys have a fantastic, God, Tuesday. I know it's just like Sunday, but it's not. Um, have a great rest of your day.